Sea Reefers, Paul here. Welcome to this episode of Marine Fish Focus. First off, let's take a trip back to the beginning of the week and see these beauties as they're finishing their period in isolation, back of house. This is our collection of beautiful, extremely rare, yellow scope has tangs making it out of isolation today um, looking exceptional you don't see many as many of these I've probably only ever handled a few in my career and we've been extremely lucky because we have got multiples which is a very rare thing to see um, there's some beautiful sizing as well we've got some tiny juveniles all the way up to sort of medium sized uh, yellow scope has. Um, they are incredibly beautiful when young, often seen with a blue halo around all the edges of the fins. So um, we'll catch these shortly and we'll be moving them into the store. Now they've finished isolation. They're very skittish, it's very difficult to get good film of these. You can see how fast they're moving. Um, but the coloration on them is superb. A real collector's fish, far more uncommon than the yellow tang. I know we don't see many of those at the moment due to the Hawaii ban. But these fish hailing from Japan and the northern Philippines of Japan, you'll never see this many or very rarely see this many. Okay, so all the tanks were now cool and they're now moved from unit four into unit six uh, from isolation into our main sow system. Um, they're just going through a process of drip acclimation at the moment. And if you can see them though, but they're looking rather smart and uh, soon to be allocated a separate room. Interestingly, they're not fighting too much actually. They normally would be a bit risky in this number but they seem to be quite calm at the moment. Um, so, looking good. Okay, well, yellow scopes are now in their new temporary homes, separating well, getting on with their tank mates, really nice. They're starting to colour up a little bit more. Like I said previously in a video, they will lose a little bit of colour initially, but they'll, they'll really, really start to shine probably over the next few days. Um, you can expect them to gain a lot more yellow as they mature with a really dark sort of uh, near the casual peduncle, the spine that's on the back of the scope has. You should start to see that darken up and the yellow intensify. And they really do stand out. We've got a few more as we come round here. Um, just getting Barry to put a little bit of food in. So you can start to see them. There's a tiny little juvenile in that one. I don't know if you can actually see that one but that one's a very very pretty little fish that particular small one with a blue halo um, and then there's some larger ones there and you can see they're a sort of mixture of yellow coloration they will change that's what makes them special and stands them out from a yellow tang because not only do you have like a beautiful red eye uh, develop but they will also um, gain a, a lot more intense yellow um, but with the da uh, very very dark near the towel um, but yeah they're doing really well very very pleased they're settling quite well I don't want to get in too close right now because uh, quite a few of them are just settling as we speak um, so there's another little bit of food going in over there we might be able to get a little bit more on that one and there's another two there so yeah doing very very well Thank you for watching our first proper go at YouTubing. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more, don't forget to like and subscribe, comment and turn on those notifications. See you soon, folks.